Lisa Wigfall, and for this week's show, we are going to make shrimp sausage with grits. We're going to start first with making the grits. All these make the perfect grits. A cup of grits. And mind you, I didn't turn the oven on, the stove on yet, so we're actually going to start with cold water and grits. We're gonna do about a teaspoon and a half of salt. If you don't salt the water with grits in the beginning, there's no way that you're gonna be able to save yourself at the end. Perfect. The shrimp that I have bought are wild caught raw shrimp. And it is shrimp. This actually is a vegan uh, form of margarine. It's not margarine, but it's called Earth Balance. It is soy free and vegan. I have already diced up a medium onion. You're gonna stir it up. You're gonna let your onions get tender, which is about five minutes. Half of a green pepper. These are vegetarian grain meat sausages. Let's check on, oh yeah. These are getting nice and tender. And here's the package by Fieldstone, simply made from grains and vegetables. They look delicious. Oh my goodness, do you believe that this is not meat? I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. I made this on President's Day for my brother and sister-in-law and family. Nobody knew that this wasn't meat. Living the pescatarian life isn't all bad. Look at that, oh delicious. This is one clove of garlic to the party. I am using uh, butter this time because I just like it to have a nice richness. Uh, what I am gonna do is I'm gonna add about a tablespoon of, I'm using tapioca starch. Toss up my shrimp with a little tapioca flour. And shrimp, they really don't take long, but I'm gonna allow these to get brown on each side. I'm dairy free, so what I like to do is I add in probably about an eighth of a cup of almond milk, just to cream it up. Just make sure when you make shrimp that nobody is allergic. My granddaddy was and he didn't know it. And we found out the hard way. They look great. Shrimp have a nice, light, delicate aroma and they look delicious. I'm gonna do a tablespoon of my tapioca flour. And I'm gonna create my roux for my gravy. I like to have a nice rich gravy with my uh, shrimp. I'm gonna allow this to kind of brown up a little bit. Ah, looks delicious. A cup and a half of organic vegetable broth for my gravy. I've added in a quarter teaspoon of the onion powder, quarter teaspoon of garlic powder, and eight of a teaspoon of ground pepper. Just a little sprinkle of cayenne. Sausage, peppers and onions. The shrimp. Mm, mm, mm. Give this a nice stir. Quarter of a teaspoon of salt. Look at the richness of everything. Worcestershire sauce. Me and my dad used to say, what's this here sauce? I'm gonna get, make sure that I get all of the goodness. I've got the sausage, I've got the pepper, I've got the onions, peppers, and the gravy. Mm, it's delicious. Try it, you definitely will like it. I'm Lisa Wigfall bringing you this week's show. I look forward to seeing you next week. And also if you don't mind, take an extra minute just to go over to my YouTube channel and just subscribe and also like and share. That's it for today. Remember to live, love, laugh. Until next week, I will see you then, bye.